All right, guys, we have our next uh, season, whatever we want to say, of Dokkan Battlefield. Uh, definitely pretty exciting. Uh, another chance to go up against Metal Cooler. Um, obviously, is always very, very fun. Um, we'll go ahead and see how this is going to be. So, it looks like Cooler is going to be uh, taken down with Physical this time. Um, I think... The number one thing I'm going to try and do is beat Cooler. Uh, I'm, we're going to start with Peppy Gals, actually. Um, it's actually, I guess, very advantageous that physical is what we want to use. Um, because I did actually want to use physical Chi-Chi in here. That's kind of like one of my big um, like, like, like things I wanted to try. Um, I Now, I mean, Dokkan, uh, like, it, it's like, okay... Like, I'll be able to get to the showcases for some of those World Tournament units. I mean, it might take a little bit, because obviously we're going to um, focus on a lot of the Tanabata stuff before we actually go to those World Tournament characters. But, like, some of them I still got to do the videos on. You know, Kale, Khalifla, um, you know, they're, they're, there's a few that we have to actually get done, uh, which we're going to do. Um, and I, one huge thing with Chi-Chi, because I saw a lot of people saying that the... Uh, world tournament chi chi was like bad or terrible and I, I don't think so because she at least will have value in here with the peppy gal team um against metal cooler um i think the peppy gal team is probably gonna be the best bet usually for players against metal cooler probably um i mean you could always use like full superhero or something like that like there's a lot of different things you could try um but i think peppy gals is just like an easy setup uh, for players to be able to do that will work very effectively all right let's um so i need to make sure not to use the peppy gals again i've kind of assembled um a nice roster of them so we'll make sure to like not use bulma for super str and stuff like that uh all right so we got frieza right away we just let frieza do this and that should be gg um i can't imagine i mean rildo is not gonna do shit to frieza remember first from frieza is still good um, I still think Frieza's destiny is to be, like, the third best unit on his team or something like that. Um, and, you know, kind of like like a, like a couple of dominant, terrifying Conqueror characters added to the team. Like, I, it would have been very easy. I, I was really hoping that Tanabata would have been Namek Saga, actually. Um, and then, you know, we could have had Carnival LR, you know, Final Form Frieza. We could have had Dokkan Fest LR, uh, Easy 8, Full Power Frieza. Um, which I think would be uh, really, really good. Alright, so let's go ahead and move on and see what the next thing is here. So, uh, we are going to be getting Extreme STR. One thing about Battlefield is these opening fights certainly don't really give much um, in terms of, like, I don't know, challenge or difficulty or anything, really. Uh, we'll bring them, uh, them, and, I don't know, LR Cooler, I guess. Uh... Yeah, so we have Cell Max. I mean, Cell Max certainly probably feels a little bit wasted. I mean, most people potentially use... Um, oh, well, yeah, there's GG there. Uh, most people are using, like, whatchamacallit, um, category teams and stuff like that, but I still have always just been, uh, done fine with the, like, super... Like, like using type teams, super int, extreme, physical, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, nowadays, I mean, so many characters have like leader skills for different categories that it's not really too tough i guess to kind of assemble it um but besides like metal cooler or omega uh really the the type teams have never really had too much issues and even with metal cooler it's only like really rng when metal cooler dodges like crazy when that guy gets to dodging like crazy it can be very ridiculous right them and baby i guess a shame about that baby, man. 2023 Dokkan. Because we've had a couple of band units this year who have been really elite, man. Um, Dispo, who I actually, at the moment, my Dispo, unfortunately, is one link away. Um, I'm eager to get to the Dispo video because Dispo uh, seems as though he's, like, at potentially the best band unit in the game. A um, couple of differences. There's one thing I didn't realize upon the initial readings of his kit. Um, which is that his crit chance permanently builds up. So, uh, a bunch of uh, supers by Dispo. And before you know it, he's going to be guaranteed critting. He's going to have really good dodge. Dispo actually seems like a very capable character to me. Um, you know, we have, obviously, uh, Evil Boo. 
um, you know, restricted to the Majin Power team, but certainly quite good over there. All right, let's go ahead and hit this. All right, moving fast. Today, I want to move fast. I'm looking for sub-25 minutes in Battlefield. That's what we're going for, sub-25 minutes. Just decimation. Uh, Vegeta, Cell, right? Um, bam, bam. Let's leave Chi Lai. Yeah, we got to leave Chi Lai. Chi Lai is very important for Peppy Gals. Because remember, Chi Lai does everything. Orb changing, scouter, heal, stun, seal, attack people. Like, Chi Lai has all of it. So she is going to be just so clutch for us um, when it comes to uh, her presence on a Peppy Gal lineup uh, here in Battlefield, right? Let's hit this. So we're probably not even going to be using uh, super physical and extreme physical. Really is quite easy for, I guess, one of these battlefield runs to potentially have, like, a bunch of different teams lined up to go for, like, the last fight. Although I have heard people say that even some of these other fights have given them trouble in battlefield here. Um, like, it's not just uh, the ending um, against Metal Cooler, but some of the other fights. I mean, I, I imagine, especially if you're, like, a newer player at all, Battlefield is going to be brutal with the amount of characters you need. And usually when you get the new Battlefield fights, I mean, they are scaled typically to, like, you know, kind of like that year's characters mostly. So the, at the start... Like, JP gets new fights, the new Battlefield fights in, like, May every year. And, like, that is, like, you know, when things usually uh, can be pretty rough, right? Uh, so, let's uh, go. What are we doing? Super AGL here. Again, we want to save our Peppy Gals. Android 21, of course, as our Peppy Gal lead. So, we'll go Pan. Um, and then them with their Elite Leader skill. Uh, we could bring them. Let's bring Ultimate Gohan. I'll bring Angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Uh, let's bring Carnival Goku, I guess, for the heal. Kid Gohan doesn't do... Oh, damn, I can't remember. Does Kid Gohan do a Key Blast? No, I think he, do he does a little combo first, right? Uh, wait a minute. God damn it. There is one thing I forgot. It's not going to be the biggest deal, but it'll give him a little bit of extra defense if they're actually guarding. Future Saga ally, which we do not have. Uh, what do we think? We think that they're they're going to be able to handle business just fine right here, right? Uh, I don't need to worry about 24 key for you. Let's just hit that. I will give Pan a lot of these EGL orbs so she gets a lot of her stats. They'll be okay right here. Yeah, double digits. Perfect. They'll dodge the super when it comes in. Watch this. Check this out. Yep, they're dodging. Yep. Easy. Yeah, that was obvious. Obviously, they were going to do it. Um, now, this character, they are still going to probably be decent in Battlefield for quite a while. Um, I mean... Okay, yeah, you know what's funny is I actually did just take uh, the EGL Super Saiyan 2 Trunks off of my Battlefield roster. Um, he could have been a future ally for them, right, to be able to get their intro up. Is there another good EGL future character? future i don't uh nothing is coming uh to my head right away i mean agl my is not the worst i mean in like a battlefield setting i think agl my potentially could be pretty solid i'm double checking that future what agl characters are there yeah it's basically just agl my um maybe i mean LR, Future, Gohan, and Trunks could easy eh, at some point. Yeah, that's GG right there. All right, bye. Not even hard. Uh, nice to be able to have Angel, Super Saiyan 3, Goku. He, of course, will be a very dominant Battlefield character pretty much forever. As long as he's got a Buu Saga ally. Ah, damn, this is going to stun him, though. No, he doesn't stun. Okay. Yeah, that kid, Gohan, is going to be a very interesting EZA. Um, future Gohan and Trunks. We've got a lot. Oh, dude, please. Can you just go to hell, Gohan? Stop it, dude. That's so stupid. Little rat. Be gone. No! No additionals? 
Bro. I cannot believe he dodged both of Goku. Like, dude, like, these characters have, like, a 10% dodge chance or some shit. These bosses. And, like, they just, like, start dodging like crazy. They're, like, they're just like me, man. It's not fair. Only I'm allowed to do that. Oh, beautiful. See ya. Dodge this, dickhead. He's not. He's not. He's not dodging that. Awesome. Gohan. Pretty good. Value from his active skill in Battlefield. We'll definitely take that. Alright, so we got that done. Beautiful. Um, yeah, who is the annoying fight? I, well, I think I, I have died to Garlic Jr. I think I have died to Evil Boo as well before. Let's do Evil Boo. Yeah, I was fighting Evil Boo in the last battlefield, and I looked down, or like, I, I set my lineup, looked up, looked down, and I died. I was like, wait, what? I don't even know how, I still, to this day, don't know what happened. Uh, Tien. I guess we'll do God Goku. So we have UI. We want Orange Piccolo. We want Tech Ultimate Gohan. Uh, I guess I'll bring Vegeta. Well, we want Gotenks. I guess Vegeta. Yeah, Jirobi is always nice to bring. But we could do something like this. Uh, UI Goku is huge for Super Tech. Super Tech hasn't had, like, the best feeling lineup. Oh, wait, wait, wait. God damn it. You know what? I wanted to save Rebrian for... Yeah. Uh, that's only two. Damn. This kid, this kid can be sealed, too, which we should take advantage of. All right. We'll do this. Um, Ribrian. I guess we could have brought Ribrian. Um, UI Goku doesn't have his intro up because we need a Universal Survival Saga ally. Let me take a look at Tech Universal Survival Saga. Again, I didn't bring Ribrian because I wanted to save her for our Peppy Gals run against uh, Metal Cooler. Um, damn. Pretty much. I mean, I guess I could have brought Tech Khalifla, but I also wanted her potentially for our battlefield. Huh. Yeah, I... There's not really a good Universal, universal Survival Saga Super Tech character... It's UI Goku and Ribran. I guess I could bring Catapesla. Bro, Catapesla is so ass. Please, man. Catapesla. I mean, maybe I should just do it. Just get Catapesla on the battlefield lineup. All right. Well, unfortunately, this bastard is going to be... He's going to time us out with that goddamn <laughs> two. God damn it. He's going to time us out, man, with the stupid heal. We need Orange Piccolo to stun. By the way, um, we'll say some of these. Camera, I was going to say. Oh, Tech Go Tanks. Tech Go Tanks. The fact that, like, we know that the dodge is, like, it's just additive now. So, Go Tanks has an 80 percent dodge after he supers with 12 key is just so crazy so he has 83 percent dodge after doing that 83 percent dodge how crazy is that so good so and I i've seen a lot of discussion about this of people saying oh well why would you how could you possibly change your rankings of characters nothing changed about them that's true, but perception is a big deal, right? So, uh, yeah, let's do, let's, no, let's do this. Um, so, like, let's just use uh, Gotenks as an example. Well, I, the best example to me is, like, Yamcha. Because Yamcha's 50% dodge or die, which is horrible, right? So, like, Yamcha, you know, every time he supers, he gets 10% chance to dodge. Turns out, it's just added to his 50% dodge which does make him quite a bit better. And, you know, I would expect a little bit more of him. So, whereas previously, 
you know, Yamcha could triple super in slot three, and then there's a bunch of attacks, and he dodges them, and I go, whew, bro, we got lucky. Whew, thank God we got lucky right there. But if I'm expecting him to have, you know, 90% or 80% dodge, and he dodges everything, and then I'm like, that's what he does, baby. He's just like that, right? Like, it's, it, it is different. Like, I don't think it's crazy if people would think, oh, this character's actually a lot better now because their dodge is higher. I mean, because you, you can't... I, for someone, like a 30% dodge character would dodge everything. And for someone, a 70% dodge character would get hit by everything, right? Like, it's like... I, Like, I do think, like, the knowledge of what it's actually like, like, like does mean something. Just put Pickle and saw one right here. Uh, I guess... Oh, wait, five. Oh, but then now it's... Yeah, damn. Because I would like to go to 11 key just to get the, the crits and the extra damage. Because, again, this rat is just sitting here healing so much. Oh, God. Yeah, that's what it is with this battlefield. So many of these bosses dodging and healing really can cause these fights to drag on. Especially, you know, super tech. Uh, you know, we don't really have the greatest uh, offensive capabilities, I'd say. Um, I think for after this, I'll probably add Catapesla to the lineup. Um, or maybe next time I'll just run Ribrian on Super Tech. Probably just, probably should just run Rib. What? 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 Bro, it did not even effing occur to me that we were going to be having this. Bro, it did not occur to me that we were going to be doing this here. Okay, well, Boo is dead. Yeah, never mind. We have God on the team, literally. Bye, Boo. See ya. Well, that was fun. <laughs> I... I just, what were they thinking with this? Dude, guys, they can make fights ridiculously, stupidly unfair toxic if this is the type of character we're getting. It's so, like, right? Like, I don't know what they were thinking giving you a character that counters when he dodges. That is so broken. And by the way, there's a damn free-to-play character that has the same ability. Who also is better because his dodge all adds up. That hit, that free-to-play hit is, dude, so. That free-to-play hit is going to be a nightmare, bro. All right, Garlic Jr. is a real pain in the dick. Uh, we want to use Kabe and um, I guess UI. We're going to save Kefla. Pe and Bulma for Peppy Gals. Bam, bam. Uh, I mean, I don't know. We got a lot of good options here. Super Vegeta, Future Gohan, I guess. Damn, I didn't even bring Dragon Fist. Super STR has a lot of characters who are just great for Battlefield. Great. Of course, those bastards are the ones. Of course, man. Those pieces of shit are the ones. I I could, by the way, put Super Vegeta in slot one, but what if he he didn't? Okay. I could have put Super Vegeta in slot one, and his guaranteed stun would trigger and hit Garlic Jr., but again, what if Garlic Jr. would have just super attacked right away? Uh, UI Goku is still pretty effective. Just make sure you do your job, buddy. That's not doing your job. It didn't hurt us, but that is not doing your job, kid. Yeah, Garlic Jr. is another annoying bastard of a fight. Um, because he 
he, of course, is another one of these bitches who's healing in here. But he also has that seal. Bosses that seal like that can be so annoying. Watch him seal beasts right here. Check this out. Oh, they're on now. Okay, well, sorry. I I had to get the mastered UI Goku transformation, of course. Did he seal beast? No, he didn't. Okay, thank God. I'll give all the S tier orbs to Kabe, I guess. Give him huge power. No reason not to. Sure, whatever. Go ahead. All right. Well, Beast didn't get sealed. That means you're dead, kid. See ya. Not actually, but he's gonna take a he's gonna take a lot of damage. Triple super triple crit loading in right here. Say goodbye to monster chunks of that HP pool, Garlic Jr. Awesome, awesome. One more? Yup. Only a normal, though. Where's this super? Huh. Kid's not super in at all. Weird. Um, okay, so I guess we're just hoping that, uh... Doesn't really matter. We probably should be able to kill next turn, regardless of who he might seal. Because, I mean, Kabe had guaranteed crits with all the SCR orbs. There's a super attack. Kabe should be okay, though, right? I mean, we are guarding. He did super attack first. Yeah, pretty good, Kabe. Nice. We'll do UI. Saw one. And that should be that. Should be that. Bro, UI, man. Please, dude. This guy, you have one job. Anytime I see him get hit, it does, because my brain just goes, okay, UI, what if that was Blue Gogeta's 4 million super UI Goku? What then? Right? Like, that's that's where my brain goes to. I see Garden get hit by a quest mode normal when I'm link leveling his, you know, unawakened SSR. And I say, Garden, what if that was Carnival Gogeta super in you, bro? What, what then? What then, buddy? Um, Gohan. Uh, them, I guess. We want Vados. Uh, remember, Vados is not Peppy, gals. Bring these two. Uh, I don't have the Super Saiyan or Movie Hero options, unfortunately. Yeah, so we'll just bring, uh, Goku. We'll do this. Yeah, Vados is not Peppy, gals. So, Vados is member busted, busted. Oh, beautiful. Great RNG right here. Um, we will leave Vados on rotation. Let's hit this. So, Vados will just completely lock this kid down. Yep. See ya. Uh, Vado get cucked by Vados, buddy. You're done. And then, I mean, the revive for Vegeta doesn't matter, but, I mean, we're going to have it up, I guess. But, again, it doesn't matter. Vegeta, his, his revive. Fat Boo is not killing us. Fat Boo is another one of these annoying bitches, by the way, who has a heal. All these bosses in here basically have heals. Very, very annoying. What? Oh, huh. Okay. Um... What, what, dude, what? Sure. I guess, yeah, get your dodges out of your system in Battlefield. That's fine, I suppose. Bro, why is he dodging? What's he dodging like that for, man? Come on. What the hell? What the hell? Vegeta dodging is, is like, so cringe, man. It really is. Even when it helps. Well... That's not actually true. It wouldn't have helped. But just Vegeta dodging is just so cringe. It, 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 it's, it, yeah. Uh, yep, that's fine. Perfect. All right. Get devastated. LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Um, he's not good for, like, the real game or the normal game. But uh, Battlefield, he's a good option for sure. 
Uh, I don't see myself taking him off of ba the battlefield lineup anytime soon. Oh my god, dude. Boo, please, man. Did they really have to give all these bosses dodge and heals? Like, it's such an annoying combo in here. They all heal and dodge, man. Oh my god, and we're getting bad luck here. Yeah, please, Super Gammas. Dodging, oh my god. Bro, their dodge chances are like 5 and 10% and shit, man. But you watch me play and you think that they have 50% dodge. Crazy. Uh, Alright, let's go. Sure, man. Whatever. Uh, Boo can't damage. Vegeta is way too good for um, Battlefield. Even if he supers right away, which he did. Sure. Be an annoying little prick today, aren't you, Boo? Yeah. Vegeta's way too good for Battlefield. Even, like, Battlefield Metal Cooler and shit is not a threat to Vegeta. Remember, Vegeta's um, two-turn crit procs right here. There we go, Vegeta. Vegeta's built up a little bit now. We have Kid Gohan with the support. Vados is supporting him a little bit because Vegeta's Realm of Gods. And Bond, a Master and a Disciple. What are the other ones? Universe 6, Realm of Gods, Bond, a Master and a Disciple, and Sibling. Oh, shit, right. He, Vegeta's on most of them. Yeah, the only one Vegeta doesn't have is Universe 6. He's on Bond of Master and Disciple, Sibling Bond, and Realm of Gods. So, Vegeta was getting 110% support. No. They give 60 now. So, Vegeta was getting 120% support. Because Kid Gohan is giving 60% to Vegeta, and Vados is giving 60% to Vegeta. Yep. Uh, awesome. Sick. I was going to say, damn, 18 million by Vegeta and Battlefield... It's pretty goddamn good. He's getting 120 support, 120 percent support, right? I mainly brought Vados for everything she's doing, right? Like she, her kit is just Vados has a godly kit, um, but I didn't even really in my head completely register how much support she gives Vegeta. Okay, can you please stop dodging and just die, boo? Bro, the way these bosses dodge, like crazy. Insanity. Goku, Trunks, and Pan are not going to finish him off. We'll, uh, we'll finish him off with a final explosion. Vegeta's final explosion will kill him. Ridiculous, dude. Turn five. Insane. Goodbye. Go to hell, boo. See ya. Alright, we got the T.O.P. KO screen right there. Beautiful. Lovely. We'll take that. Major W, Major W. All right, here we go. Metal cooler time. So we have super physical, extreme physical, uh, and peppy gals all ready to go here. Let's do peppy gals. Um, so we want to do 21 and then... Oh, shit. Who's our secondary leader going to be? Bulma? Yeah, not them. Bulma doesn't lead Peppy Gals. Uh, I guess Int Ribrian. Int Ribrian, yeah. Chi-Chi. Bulma. chi -Lai. Physical Giant Ribrian. We could bring Physical Giant Ribrian here for sure. Yeah, let's bring um, STR Kefla and Ribby. Do I even want to bring Ribby in? I want to bring Mamba. I'm bringing Mamba. Yeah. Ma we're bringing Mamba. All right, let's see. Turn one could be spooky, depending upon what we get here. Ribby is good. Passive debuff. Now, again, I think Chi-Chi... I, I thought people were going a little too crazy with, oh my god, Chi-Chi is so terrible. I, I think she can be good in this environment. Yeah, we want this. is Dude, like, people will get, like, this turn and they say, oh my god, Battlefield Metal Cooler is a bitch. Oh, what do we got here? One, two, three. Four. Four. He's supering four times? Four supers? No, it's three. 
No, it's only two. This kid... Oh, you've fallen off, buddy. Two supers? Are you an idiot? This guy's a moron, chat. Three supers. Who does he think he is? Uh, I mean... Well... Uh, yeah, we'll do this, sure. I guess... I guess it's possible he could... Well, I guess he could dodge everything. At the end of the day, he can just dodge everything. We didn't stun him. We did seal. We do need to stun him, though. Because, again, the rat bastard uh, will just be healing. She's at double digits. Beautiful. So, she only did two dodges right there. It's actually pretty clutch. Because three dodges procs her heal. She only did two. Alright, Metal Cooler. Yep, time to just dodge everything. Oh my god, I hate Metal Cooler so much. Uh, Okay, we're not really doing a ton of damage. Not really doing very much damage. Okay, there's the stun. Yeah, 21 gets her stun off. Uh, Okay, we're going to need to uh, actually do damage to him, though. What the hell? We're, we're like... We're doing nothing to him. Nothing. Did they... Did they buff his HP? Bro? What? We're not even... We didn't even do anything to him. He's stunned. Okay. So, I guess, well... I guess with, with him stunned, we're not really going to be able to see so much. But Chi-Chi... Is going to do a lot of stuff that's actually going to help us here. Um, Chi Chi on her super attack has a high chance to stun. Uh, Chi Chi from her passive will lower Metal Cooler's attack and defense by 22% for three turns. So, like, those two. And then she has, like, a lot of different... Like, she's got, like, some dodge abilities and stuff like that. Additional stuff like that. Uh, like, I looked at Chi Chi and I felt like Chi Chi was a nice option in here. Um, so, like, if she gets the stun right here, like, bam, there we go. No stun, unfortunately. She has two guaranteed normals. They're just normals, unfortunately. Okay, hit him with tension system. It's a normal. God damn it. All right, well. Uh, all right, Mamba has a weapon super, so we can get some weapon super uh, added to that title, baby. All right, so we, we, we've debuffed Metal Cooler heavily. Unfortunately, Chi Chi did not get her stun to proc. Huh. Uh, he is so debuffed. Let's go Chi Chi slot one, Kefla slot two. Kefla is what we need for the damage against this kid. All right, Chi Lai, make sure you're coming through, girl. Yep, beautiful. Bro, we only have 10 turns. I, I gotta... Yeah, I gotta... Dude, did they buff his HP? Uh, let's see. So I could pull up Battlefield 75 and Battlefield 76. Yeah. Did he just dodge Kefla? No way, bruh. Metal Cooler, last battlefield, 135 million. He has 135 million this time. They nerfed him. He has less damage. Yeah. Met Metal Cooler is weaker. Let me see. I want to compare him to the first battlefield he was in. You're stunned, okay. Yeah, keeping him stun locked will keep him from healing. Yeah, let, let me look at the stats from the first battlefield, but they nerfed him. He's not as strong as he was last month. Dude, can you stop dodging? Oh my, dude, I hate, like, this, oh my god. Can you stop dodging? Like, every time I look over, he's dodging a fucking attack, man. Stop dodging. Every time I look over, he's dodging. Bro, the first Metal Cooler... Man, like, dude, global players were so annoying. Like, uh, he was so easy, bro. His damage was literally half. Stop it, dude. Please. 
Uh, they did lower his damage, though. Yeah, his damage is down. Uh, so the tech metal cooler is is the hardest. Then the int one, he's because tech metal cooler is 360 and he's down to 324. The AGL metal cooler is at 180. So again, he's pathetic Com in, in comparison. Yeah, get those stuns off and stuff like that. Bro, I don't know if we're going to kill him in time. I, I don't know. Probably not, huh? I mean, hopefully Kefla's attacks will connect, I guess. We need Kefla to do that damage. Girl, do that damage, girl. We got plenty of orbs. He's stunned, so no need to worry there. Okay. Uh, one thing about keeping Kefla next to Chi-Lai is chi is going to be making sure Kefla has her orbs, right? As you guys know, I love Chi- Oh my god. The biggest damage dealer we have. And he's like, watch me dodge every attack she does. Okay. Can you crit, girl, please? Please crit. Well, at least every super attack, her damage is stacking. It. I guess it probably sucked that we had her start and saw- Oh, nice. That's hit him with his system, right? It's unfortunate that she- oh, Dude, oh my god. I can't, I hate this shit so much. He dodges so much. I, like, people were like, oh my god, his dodge chance is so small, it's not a big deal at all. Like, people just say shit, man. <laughs> There's no way. He's, you can't hit him. Bro, you can't hit this guy. He is him. He's crazy. He dodges everything, man. I hate this fight so much. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. All right, Chi-Chi, get a stun in, please. Perfect. Perfect. W. Oh, Chi-Chi also does... She would have did it last turn. But um, every time Chi-Chi uh, does five attacks, uh, she gets a guaranteed additional super. Certainly good to uh, keep Metal Cooler stun locked. Damn, guys. I don't know. I Like, we're going to lose, man. We're losing. We're not getting crits. We're not getting additional supers. Uh, Metal Cooler is dodging every goddamn attack we do. Like, we're going to lose, bruh. I don't know why this kid is allowed to dodge everything when he's stunned. Why is he dodging? Bro, you're stunned. You should just be sitting there. I'm going to keep 21 in base so she stuns, by the way. No way this kid should be dodging as much as he does. Kefla, please put him away, baby. Kefla can put him away, man. Yes, baby. Look at that damage. Oh! Today we care about damage. Hell yeah, Kefla. Awesome. 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 Bro, every time I look over, he's dodging like crazy. What the hell? Never seen anything like this guy before, man. This dodges every attack known to man. All right, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. All right. I don't think um, there's anything new in the shop for us to pick up. I think there is still a copy of GT Cell and Frieza that I did not purchase from last time. But I'm going to let them just sit there until I could rainbow them. Yeah, Battle for Rewards are very good. Let's take, let's double check. Um, but you guys know how it is with this stupid-ass battlefield shop. Ev oh, I want that. I actually want this, too. And I actually want this, too. Um, what they do with this stupid battlefield shop is they're like, oh, you're not caught up? Well, don't worry, because we're going to add 50 more characters. Yeah, so 470, 
that would be the second dupe for them. So I'd still need two dupes afterwards. Like, look, why does it cost so much, man? God. I, I would love to get this guy as a TUR, but yeah, that's not happening. And I still would love to rainbow these four as well, but we're just going to keep saving. No reason to use our currency this battlefield. Let me know what you guys think. Battlefield, Denzo.